Now, first, we start with new details in the 40-year-old cold case that has finally been closed. Yeah, two children brutally murdered back in 1981, and now, 42 years later, detectives say they know who killed the Alexander siblings. THV 11, Sarah Horbakowitz sat down with the lead investigators who solved the case. Sarah, how'd they crack this case? Faith, solving a cold case is a rare feat, and in this case, it came down to DNA evidence and taking a second look at a suspect who was close to the case from the start. In 1981, Weldon Alexander came back to his Texarkana home from an overnight shift and called authorities. He said he found his two kids, Karen and Gordon Alexander, stabbed in his home. When police arrived, Gordon was dead. Karen was still breathing, but died days later from her injuries. A homicide investigation began and would continue for another 42 years. The case was a whole lot different than what it looked like and from the start. Captain Calvin Seward spent the majority of his career with Texarkana Police on this case, even coming out of retirement 18 months ago to solve it. We didn't just work on this for a few hours a day, 24 seven, you wake up at two o'clock in the morning, what did I miss? And so you go over and over and over and over this stuff. He worked alongside Todd Steffi, a forensic consultant and now cold case detective for the state police. The two of them taking a fresh look at DNA. They collected physical evidence that and preserved it for all these years in such a way that we were able to actually get some DNA that we could work with. They looked closely at fingernail DNA of the victims and used that to adjust original conclusions about the time of their death. All the pieces of the puzzle kind of coming together, uh, and especially once we identified that anchor point and said, you know, I think we got the time of death wrong, maybe on the front end. Soon after that realization, the pair, alongside help from the state crime lab and facts from those who came before them, compared that time with original 1981 statements and solved the case. I think not only have we reached the level of probable cause, but we've reached beyond a reasonable doubt. It is a uh, closed case as far as I'm concerned. They say the person responsible for killing those two kids is the same person that first called police, their father, Weldon. It has a lasting effect on you and, and it never goes away. I'll never forget this case. It'll always be a part of me. Weldon Alexander died in 2014. As for Captain Seward, he says he's already planning on going back in to hopefully solve other cold cases.